uh, but be the coach. The other guy's doing the work and we're going to rotate around the outside. So you're going to go to every station every eight seconds or 10 seconds, top of it. Um, so what we've got here is we've got a decision making. So what will happen is the guys who are stationed on the, on the, in the same place will stand here with a bag. And it'll be a player over there, so player jump over there please, quick. So on, go. Go back further, back to the line. Righto, so you're going to come in. Now if I, if I come at the same time as you, what are you going to do? You're going, you're going to clean out. So you're going to clean me out, take me away from the ball. If I go like this and then don't come, what are you going to do? He's going to play the ball and he's going to use a bit of evasion. Right, I don't want him tearing away across there because you're running to someone else in the grid. So it's just a case of using a bit of footwork. Right, clear on that? So you're either cleaning out or you're playing the ball. No contact sir. No, I don't need any contact. No. Uh, this one here, someone lie on here, please. So the person on the inside is lying here. What we're going to do is we're going to get rid of this body. So this, this is our player who's been tackled. This is their player slowing our ball down. How do we get rid of him? Come and show. You've lifted our player as well? No. Any player? Oh, no. Just no, get just under him. Just over there. Yeah. Okay, let's so. trim again then. Okay. So, you yeah, know that works for you? I'm going to go in and I don't want to smash him. Why not? Okay. Oh, someone else coming. Yeah, what the hell do you do? Yeah, I'll smash him. Do it, Jack. What do you, what'd you do? How? Getting under him. What'd you use? Your shoulder, your head, your chest, your arms and got low. Okay, so this is a bit easier because it's a bag. It's a little bit artificial. Someone else come and lie on here. How else do we get rid of this person? Now, I showed you a video where Chief scored. Scrum, winger carries, clean out, try. How'd they clean that out? He just came through and just took the guy straight with him. Took his shoulder out. Shoulder. shoulder. So what we're doing is we're coming in and we're dropping the shoulder. So we get a shoulder into here, we chase them through and we end up in that position. So we get them off the ball quickly, but we end up in a position where we're up and the referee can't penalise us. So to do that, we have to get nice and low, get shoulder on, chase our feet through. So that's a wide base. If I get a narrow base and I do this, I end up doing that. And then what happens? Yeah, yeah, probably. Okay, so to do this, and I don't know about the quality of your refs in the country either, so you need to make sure that you are hitting and chasing feet and staying up. Okay? I don't, I don't, you don't have to use what I just said then. It's the most effective way to get rid of someone though. But if you've got a way, big South Africans come in, they pick guys up like you say and they bulldoze them off. If you can do it immediately, it's fine. Okay, but whatever it does, You've got to get quick ball off this. So no good getting in here and pulling him in here on top of the ball, because it slows your pull down. Right on. Uh, this one here, it's going to be the guy on the inside. Just got to be on the ball here. And we're going to clean him out, get under his chest. Okay, so just hit, drive a little bit. Don't need to put him on the ground. Then we rotate round. These, these same three things are in multiple positions. So you, on the inside, you're either lying on the bag, holding a shield, or low over the ball. You stay there until everyone's been round. Then we swap. Feedback and move! Move! Ready! There you go, Trick. There you go. Give Ace good. Ready! Left. Why are you guys coming this way? Try and get. Uh, you should have got them off with your head. Good job, though. Good! There you go, bro. Ready! Ready. Yeah, you need to take right. evasion. I think they take contact. Now boys, we're not looking to run into that bag if we pick the ball up, we're using our feet. Ready! Chase our feet when we're cleaning. Chase our feet. Ready. Good. 
Good, good. Feel it in? Feel it? Yeah. Tell him it was good. Ready. Move, move. Can you get a shoulder on you? No, So we could do it like this. It's going to be a little more realistic. I want you to try and fight to stay in there. So me trying to push you, I'm not going to get him off. So we need to use shoulders. So I'll just say one thing. When we're hitting here, what do we need to do with our feet? Square them up. Keep them underneath you. Keep wide, Square, wide. wide base. Yeah. Okay, so when we're coming in, it might be narrow. We're obviously, we're running in. But we need to get our feet wide, and then what? Drive the Drop down. Drop your hips. So we, we're <coughs> squatting down. We're going to hit. So I get into this position. I get into here. What else? What now? Yeah, drive. Drive through. Drive Power step. Pop. Drive. So drive. I'm in here. And I pop my legs. And I try and do a yeah, bit of an app. But I hit him and I chase my feet. A little bit easier with momentum. Yeah. So what I should end up with, line again, is I'll do it from in contact. See if I can get you off that. So we're in here. I'm trying to hit him in here. I want you to fold off from your belly. So you pump, 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 pump up. And you're up there. So see how what I'm trying to do is enter my feet up as I'm hitting. And we showed an example of that of one of our Lucy's yesterday on the video where he just come in and he got that low position. He just feet like that and the ball's in and it's gone. Okay? In that situation, yeah. Look, be honest, I'm, I encourage our boys to use our knees if they're a bit light on the ground. You've got to go in about 10 seconds. But um, if I was contesting in here and I was going to go for the ball, I, I'd throw my knees in here. The reason is because the rest aren't looking at your knees, but it gives you a balance. So I can get into here, I can be here. So I'm actually, I'm really not really supporting my weight, but it looks like I am. <laughs> okay? So by getting your knees in here, we're in here, now we're in the fight. So I can get really low, stay in there, no hands on the ground. Okay, so the opposite to that, when we're cleaning out, we need to be in there, chasing feet to eliminate that thread.